Hello, I'm Dr. Edward Erb. I'm a vascular and endovascular surgeon. I grew up in Middletown, Ohio, a small town between Cincinnati and Dayton. It's mostly a town of uh, uh, Scotch-Irish immigrants from Eastern Kentucky. Um, factories, steel, paper, paper mills. It was, uh, Middletown was made famous uh, recently in a book by J.D. Vance, Hillbilly Elegy. Um, yeah, I went to Miami University for undergrad and Ohio University for medical school. Um, I did uh, my general surgery training in Dayton, Ohio, uh, and then vascular surgery in uh, University of North Texas Health Science Center. Um, I also had the opportunity to do endovascular training um, with um, Dr. Edward Dietrich in um, Arizona Heart, Phoenix, Arizona. After, after medical school, I started a practice in Dayton, Ohio. Uh, when I got married, my wife was from the Hill Country area, and uh, there was an opportunity here, and, and we were excited to, to be able to come to the Hill Country. Uh, Kerrville is Texas. Um, when people think of Texas, or when people think of the Hill Country, I think they're thinking of bucolic Kerrville. I've been with Peterson Medical Associates for three years. I felt vascular surgery was a very critical area of medicine, uh, but being a doctor is a very unique privilege. You get to play an integral part in a patient patient's life when they when they are at need. Um, I, I enjoy getting to know the patients. I work predominantly with with the elderly, and it's a uh, it, it's a privilege. It's a real privilege to, to to be able to help people when they when they need it most. A vascular surgeon treats uh, carotid disease for stroke prevention. Most strokes are caused by blocked carotid arteries. Um, most strokes can be prevented if we if we if we are able to identify that and, and uh, remedy it before the stroke occurs. We also treat aneurysms, which is an enlargement of the arteries to prevent rupture and death. Um, we treat uh, um, wounds of the lower extremity with uh, um, due to blocked arteries um, with bypasses, stents, angioplasty. We treat varicose veins, um, spider veins, um, blood clots. Uh, we also take care of uh, dialysis patients with uh, keeping the accesses open uh, with catheters or um, uh, act fistulas or, or grafts. I chose vascular surgery because it's a very uh, detailed um, surgery. Um, there's still a little bit of an art to it. Um, a, a lot of surgeries have moved more away from actual art and technique to uh, uh, automatic devices, things like that, and, and vascular surgery still is very detailed. You're sewing tiny arteries together with tiny uh, veins uh, with, with suture about as thick as your hair. It's also a, a uh, pioneering area uh, where there's a lot of new things happening in, in vascular surgery, mainly involving minimally invasive techniques with atherectomy catheters, small catheters that cut plaque out of arteries, uh, thrombectomy catheters, small devices that remove clot from arteries, angioplasty, stenting. Uh, we have new drug-eluting stents now, drug-eluting balloons, drug uh, devices that um, uh, open an artery but then also uh, impregnate the artery with, with a medicine that helps uh, improve patency or the durability of the repair. It's a very exciting time for vascular surgery and that's what makes it so fascinating. When I'm not at work, I have a, a family. Um, we, we enjoy uh, the uh, hill country uh, activities, kayaking and um, hiking. When I'm not doing that, I'm usually uh, playing taxi to my kids, taking them to different activities. I do most of the cooking at home, so I, I end up busy, busying myself with uh, uh, cooking and such. I love Peterson Health because it's a, it's a very unique uh, hospital in a unique town um, and it's not just a building but it's, it's, a, it's a group of great people. The hospital staff is just a, a wonderful staff of great people. Um, I've worked in a lot of big city hospitals and a lot of uh, different hospitals but, but this is truly a unique staff of really not just great physicians but great people. There, there's really good people here and not just the physicians but all the staff is, is, is just, just exceptional and it's a, it's, it's a real privilege and honor to be a part of the staff at Peterson Health.